Ski Do. This is going to be a separate video for, or this is a separate video for another one of the art books that I just recently got in the mail. Um, this one is for Hiro no Kakeda 4. Um, I don't remember the actual name other than that it's number four. This is bothering me. Go away. Okay, sorry. This tripod is very, this is not even a tripod, it's a very sad homemade version. Um, oh, here, one moment. I like taking these off so I don't wreck them when I'm looking through them. So the cover of this one is also kind of like a fun, <laughs> I love these, a fun sketched out version of the front cover which actually looks like that, so the comparison is that. I don't know if you can see very well. I can't move my camera, so, and then the front is actually that. And the back just has a bird on it. And I'm just gonna do a quick flip through this because I want to um, keep the video short. So. Mm, the character design is so nice. I'm glad that the art seems nice and big so far. Oh, and it has their other forms too. That's cool. And all their different expressions over here. Their different expressions and such. All the different characters. They actually did translate this game in English, but it's only um, as an app on, a, I don't know if it's on Android, it's probably on Android, but it is on iOS for sure. Um, but the problem is, is they don't have the voice acting. So I haven't actually bought any of the characters yet because I am obsessed with voice actors and I want to hear them actually talk. And it disappoints me if they don't. Plus, each character is like $6 or something and I don't have the money right now because of course I'm buying art books. Art book binge, yes. So I'm glad that the art seems um, so far fairly uh, large. Even the CGs are decent sizes. So that's nice. Mm, I love that picture so much. The artist for this does a really good job as well. I believe there's actually two games for Hiro no Kakura 4 uh, as well. I don't know if I can find the art book for the second for the second game. Oh wait, it has one of these oh, again. What's this? Vlogs. I know that's the people who publish the book. So other books have? I guess they have an Uduno Prince Sama. And it looks like a Diabolic Lover one. Diabolic Lovers. Um, yeah, anyway. We'll leave that in there. Oh, it's so hard do this. I also have this thing for old men, like old scruffy men characters. Like them. Not like really old, of course, because... But regardless, I like them scruffy characters. It's my thing. Not sure why, but I like them. Maybe I just like the experience. I don't know. And then the, the younger character, they're always cute too, though. Gonna keep flipping through this quickly. He's really, really pretty. I'm like, geez. Why are all the male characters prettier than I am? That should not be allowed. <laughs> oh, I love that one so much. Mm, that one too. I love winter scenes as well. Oh, that's cool. It shows his paws. And they slowly turn into like feet. That's awesome. Okay, I like that. Um. Yeah, what's nice about this one is the pictures are really large. The page quality is not bad either, but the pictures are really nice and large, and I'm big on that because I have bad eyes as it is. So I have to get super close to things to see, and um, oh, the art's just so pretty. I wonder, I should actually look for the, oh, some writing stuff, quite a bit of writing stuff. There's probably interviews or some sort of something. Oh, uh-huh. Here's some of the more sketchier looking art. Ooh. Okay, I like that a lot. That makes me happy. I'm glad that that's there. So yeah, if you wanted to know what this book looked like, 
it looked like that. So, awesome. Yay, and it was only five minutes. That's not bad. Good job. Also, this is one of the ones with less pages. Anyways, okay, I'll see you guys in the next one, and we'll look at a Tokino Kizuna art book. Well, Alright, see you then.